I'm very pleased. I mean, um, it's always a good opportunity, especially to, to come back into the NPL um, after having a couple of years in, in State 1 in Victoria. And it was good to, um, to, to achieve um, my previous club's goals, Geelong, and, and I'm really looking forward to helping to, to achieve Altona's goals. Um, and hopefully we can make finals football this year. Uh, obviously, as I said, I'm looking forward to being in an NPL set up again. Um, that's probably the most thing I'm looking forward to. Uh, I'm looking forward to a fresh start as well. Uh, looking forward to meeting all the boys and, and, and playing in the style how Goran wants us to play and I can't wait to rip in day one. So obviously, it's got a deep, rich history, um, various VPL titles um, and, and, and it goes a long way back into the, you know, the 50s and 60s so um, yeah hopefully we can we can contribute to, to Altona's history and, and, and uh, produce some more silverware this year. Yeah absolutely so Goran's obviously got a, a long rap sheet um, and huge respect um, in the Victorian Football Leagues um, from top to bottom so um, to be a part of that uh, is exciting. Uh, we're looking forward to it. Oh, I think finals football is definitely achievable for the club and I think we can go one step further. Uh, I think with the depth in the current squad, um, the recruitment drive the club's put in um, in the off-season and, and continuing to do that, I think we can go a long way. Yeah, the FFA Cup's definitely taken off in the last few years and it's something you know I've been fortunate enough to be a part of previously, um, playing in the round of 32 twice. Um, so, and you know, that was one of my most fond memories um, as a footballer, so to be a part of the national stage, um, again, is something definitely on the radar and, and hopefully we can achieve that.